The wheel kit comes with front and back metal plates, 3D printed handles, magnetic paddle shifters, a housing and some bolts. We will also need to add some electronics, switches and encoders. There are two screen covers to choose from, one for a 4.3 inch screen and one for fitting a TM1638 display. Choose a display to install and use the matching cover. The first step is to paint or to cover the front metal plate with carbon vinyl. With the front plate covered, install the buttons, toggle switches and encoders. Next, fit the knobs to the encoders. To finish the 3D printed display cover, lightly sand and prime, then paint. Install the front display cover to the metal plate using the bolts and by placing nuts on the back. Next install the screen onto the bolts and place nuts on the back to secure. To cover the handles use a piece of suede leather and cut slightly larger than the part. To wet form the shape, place the suede into water for approximately 20 minutes. Squeeze out any excess water and begin to shape around the plastic handles. While shaping the form, use pegs to hold in place. With all the handles covered, place these aside to dry. For the wiring of the switches and encoders, we will use a Pro Micro using the same matrix wiring as the previous button box. When wiring the switches, also allow wires for the paddle shifters. Mount the paddle shifters to the back metal plate then install four long nuts and the bolts to the back plate. Install the housing cover, then pass the wire in through the holes and solder to the buttons. Solder a wire to the centre pin of both of the paddle shifters as a common wire. Then solder one of the earlier prepared wires to the paddle shifter switch. With the wiring complete, close the back cover. On the front, install the four bolts to secure the front cover to the back plate. When the handles are dry, remove the pegs and use a suede brush to remove any peg marks. Cut and trim the excess material on the back so the suede sits flat against the handle. To glue the suede to the handles, apply contact adhesive to both surfaces with a small brush. Before joining together, insert two nuts into the front handles. Then cover the handles with the suede pressing firmly into the corners. On the back of the handles, place a small cut for the bolts and push the bolts through these holes. Place the front handle with the pre-installed nuts onto the wheel. Turn the wheel over place the back handles on the back and tighten the bolts. Repeat this process to fit the second handle and complete the wheel build. 